Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be making a video on the outfits that I'm going to wear at EDC Las Vegas. If you aren't sure what EDC Las Vegas is, it's basically just a big ol' um, rape. So um, I'm keeping it basic this year. I went two years ago and I um, amped it up just a little bit, but I don't like to wear so much stuff to where I'm feeling hot and crowded and because I don't know, usually when I'm, I don't know, I won't say I'm claustrophobic, but I kind of get like anxiety when I'm too tight and I can't breathe and stuff like that. So I'm keeping it very, very minimal. So if you would like to see what I'm going to wear at EDC Las Vegas, um, then keep watching this video. And if you like it, give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe because I'm watching you and I know if you aren't subscribed, so subscribe to my channel. Okay. Anyways. So for day one, I'm going to keep it very chill and minimal because we are not getting into Vegas um, till the day of the concert because, um, I don't know, just like all the flights are booked and stuff like that. So it didn't, the odds didn't end up in our favor. So we're getting there super late around 10 o'clock um, Friday. So I'm going to keep it very minimal. I'm going to go with this bodysuit. It's just like an olive uh, green bodysuit and it's like a button up. So. Um, I'm gonna go with this bodysuit and no, I'm not super thin or anything like that So I'm gonna but I don't care like the rave community doesn't care everybody's super nice and they're not like judgmental at all And if they are punch them in the face just kidding you might get kicked out, but oh well just screw them But anyways the first day I am going with this bodysuit. I got this bodysuit at Ross for like uh, It was five dollars. I think I think it was like No, six dollars. I think it was five ninety nine. So I'm gonna go with that and I either plan to pair it with um, these little Sphinx they're just like little flag Sphinx I got these from a friend they she let me borrow them one time and we stopped being friends so I never gave them back to her so that's not my problem it's either that or I'm gonna pair it with some shorts like this um, these are just a little like track shorts I got these from Aeropostal um, I'm not gonna use gray I am gonna go pick up some black ones but um, Yes, that's what I plan to do for day one. I'm going to keep it super simple and like minimal so I can be comfortable and, you know, still be able to breathe. But yes, that's what I'm probably going to wear for day one. Oh, and I'm more than likely going to wear these fishnet um, tights under them. Usually when you wear fitnet, fish, fitnet, fishnet, it just ties everything together. So I have a couple of pairs of these. So I might wear these the first day and the third day. The second day I'm going to wear something like chill and it doesn't need fishnet so um yes but we get the concept okay so for day two um i'm also gonna keep it pretty minimal like i said everything is pretty minimal but um i'm gonna wear this little top this is like a top and bottom set but let's go over the top first it has these little like slits on the back i got this from aeropostal this is like ten dollars they were having this big old sale so I picked up a lot of stuff and um, like I said I'm not the type to wear so much stuff I know like usually when you go to raves and stuff like that everybody's super duper creative and the last time that I went I created some of my own like bras and stuff like that but this year I decided just to pick up like small things just so I can be super duper comfortable and this is kind of what I came up with so um like I said this is the top it just has little like flowers and stuff like that which I really liked so the bottom part it's just plain little black Sphinx but they kind of have like a little mesh here on the side and it has a very thick waistband so it's not like it doesn't slide down or anything like that these I got for six dollars at Aeropostal so um, yes that's just a good idea usually just tops and bottoms that match is a good outfit nobody really cares and for every day I'm just gonna be wearing this fanny pack I got this from Victoria's Secret um, I like taking this because it's in the front like it's not like a backpack or anything like that to where you can't pay attention to it in the back and so I get keep from getting jacked or anything like that I usually make this the biggest as it can go like I stretch it all the way and then I'll tie it in a knot and then I'll um, clip it like that just so I can make sure I don't lose it or I don't get jacked or it doesn't break or anything like that keep it super secure and I usually keep my money and stuff like that in here can you do this for me real quick Okay, and for the last and final day, I'm going to keep it very, very dark like my soul. I'm going to wear this little um, crop top right here. This is from Forever 21. I got this for $5, and it's super stretchy, and it's kind of like almost like a dry fit material. Uh, it is, and it's pretty um, like tight to the body, but it kind of also 
compresses your body a little bit so that's why I fell in love with this top um, I'm gonna pair that with the gray shorts that I showed you earlier just basic little track shorts but I thought that was very cute because I'm in love with this little track short concept I originally wanted to do um like leggings they had leggings like this they were gray with a white stripe and I wanted to pair that with a white crop but they didn't have the white crop in my size so I completely just went away with that and I got the shorts so under those shorts is when these one of these pairs of fishnets are gonna come into play so yes just all black everything and ugh. and for the shoe parts please guys don't freaking wear I wore Converse the first time that I went and my feet were crying. So what I did this year, I got me a cheap little pair. These are just little black shoes, but these are so comfortable. I think these are like what the little like old ladies and stuff wear. I got these at Walmart. These were like $6. And what I'm going to do is get like one of those inserts, like super duper comfortable inserts. And um, I'm going to put these in there and I'm going to wear these with every single one of my outfits because it will match with every single one of the outfits because they are black and they're they're kind of cute like when you put them on they're not bad they don't look like too much and they don't look like like too less if that makes sense so I'm just gonna pair all of my outfits with these black shoes because like I said I wore Converse last year and they were super I mean not last year two two years ago and they were super duper uncomfortable don't wear Converse my friends were super smart and some of them wore um, Nikes and stuff like that the first year I went I wore fluffies so uh, I mean if you want to wear fluffies and stuff like that I would suggest you wear tennis shoes because you can't even see the tennis shoes it doesn't matter what shoe like wear the most comfortable shoe because there's a lot of ground to cover and you're gonna be standing up for a really really long time so please do not wear Converse don't wear Vans anything like that please don't my feet like literally wanted to punch me in the face my outfits aren't completely 100% sure the one that I would say I'm kind of iffy about is the first one the bodysuit so if I don't wear that bodysuit I might just wear this shirt right here I got this at Rue 21, it's just a cop, crop top and it just says good vibes and it laces up here so you can like loosen it or tighten it to however much you want. I got this shirt for like $3 at Rue 21 so if I do decide to wear this instead I'll probably go get either some white shorts or maybe like one of these color shorts or maybe I even might just wear um, Spanx with the fishnet so I'm kind of indecisive about the first one. I don't know if I want to wear a bodysuit because whatever I have to go to the restroom and I mean, it still has buttons at the bottom, but I don't know if I'm comfortable wearing the bodysuit. I might just wear the bodysuit with maybe some jeans or something and then wear it to go out to dinner. That might make sense, but I'm really indecisive about the first outfit because I forgot I got this one and I was looking through my closet, so I don't know. As far as hair accessories, like how I'm going to wear, I'm probably going to take these because these are actually kind of comfortable as to these. I also have these and I would much more likely wear these but this gives me a freaking headache like I know I told y'all once before that I get headaches really easily when things are like tight on my head or when I'm wearing the wrong color oh my god I just broke it or when I'm wearing like the wrong color sunglasses I get headaches really easily and this kind of just this little part right here pinches my head a little bit too much and I get really bad headaches so I might wear this um or I might even tie like some bandanas one time I even wore like glitter tulle I just tied it in a big old bow. So I might go pick up some tool. Um, I'm not going to try those on for you guys because I feel super duper icky. I started my period. I know too much information, sorry. But um, I don't feel like kind of putting on clothes and taking it off because I feel super duper bloated and just really icky. But I will definitely um, make a video after I come back just to show y'all my outfits each day and just to check in with y'all like what I wore and stuff like that and how the experience went. Um, I do want to vlog most of like being in Vegas but I'm not sure because I never found a camera and my phone doesn't like hold that much storage. I have no idea why because um, I don't think I have that much stuff on my phone for it to take up all my storage but for some reason it doesn't want to like hold storage so you know. Um, but what I will do is I will insert um, some pictures of what I wore to EDC uh, a couple of years ago so you can also get some ideas from that like I said I don't like to be super gory just because I don't like to wear that much like heavy clothing and stuff that's just gonna bother me so I like to keep it very 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 minimal if you liked this video and it was helpful to you please give it a thumbs up um, if you have any other video suggestions leave it in the comment section below and I will help y'all as to like 
like if y'all would like to see a follow-up video like what I'm gonna actually take to the concert like how I'm gonna hold my money how I'm gonna um, just like manage my cards and stuff like that like if I'm gonna take a backpack or anything like that I don't think I'm gonna take a backpack I think for sure it's just gonna be my fanny pack and uh, my phone because I have a case with all the card slots but if you want to see a video like what I actually take into the concert and what you can and can't take give this video a thumbs up and also leave me um, a comment in the comment section down below and I will do that for y'all but as for now I will see y'all in my next video I hope that you all enjoyed this one and I'll see y'all in the next